all right guys so now we are continuing with the same application that we were working with so in this video i will teach you a very very important concept which applies to almost all pro all programming languages like java c sharp uh, php maybe uh, javascript uh, this is uh, methods for example a method can be used when you have uh, uh, say different uh, different uh, how can I say it different uh, users in your application and that uh, you want to limit uh, the amount of code being used for example you want to you want to use a try concept that is to not repeat yourself uh, then you would use method let me show you with a, with an example that you so that you understand me better so let's create a method uh, public we write the access modifier which will which in our case will be public right now public void I will cover access modifier in a later video session void is the uh, data type of this method and the name of the method will be my method we write this bracket which uh, are the parameters right now it's, there are no parameters in it I will cover parameters in a later session for now I will just make a basic video for this method in this method I want to display a message box hello world and that's all I want to do I would create another method public void my method to and this one mm, I will write a different message let's say message box dot show hello, hello YouTube YouTube okay so now we have two methods two different methods once with the form load I want to display only one method for instance I want to display my method once the form load I write the method name as well as this two bracket which are used as parameters and then I load the form I execute the form we get the hello world message as expected we close the form let's say I want to include two methods now I want to include my method too I include this of course I need to put the semicolons after each method I guess hello world, hello YouTube we get both messages just as expected right now you probably can't see the use of this because there are not much codes but when there are a lot of line of codes this would come very handy so these were methods in the next video I will show you you parameterize methods thanks for watching